President Paul Kagame has noted that the bilateral relations between Rwanda and India have continued to flourish and that two countries are looking to deepen that, relation, that relationship. The Rwandan president met the REMAX during the year's Raising a Dialogue, meant to address global issues. This year, the focus is on the COVID-19 pandemic and India's Prime Minister Narendra Modi is also attending. During the virtual discussions, President Paul Kagame pointed out just how serious the global pandemic has become. COVID is a public health crisis, but it is also a crisis of international cooperation. Access to vaccines is highly unequal. In a situation of scarcity, power and wealth will always set the temple. India, despite its own challenges, has produced most of vaccine doses sent to Africa under COVAX and related programs. Without India's production capacity and spirit of solidarity, it is possible that Africa would not yet have received much vaccine at all. This unsustainable situation demonstrates the opportunity for more ambitious private sector investments between India and Africa in pharmaceutical manufacturing, among other areas. The relationship between India and Rwanda continues to flourish and our goal is to further deepen our ties. Rwanda and India continues to collaborate on important infrastructure and development initiatives. The key objective is to increase the educational and employment opportunities available to young people in both India and Rwanda. Knowledge, innovation, and the green economy will still be the key drivers of growth after the pandemic. The Observer Research Foundation's annual Kigali Global Dialogue is another good example. This event brings a fresh perspective to global debates on development and growth and attests to increasing multipolarity of our world.